Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna be doing a come shop with me to Home Bargains and I've also got a Home Bargains haul for you. Now, I know I've been doing a lot of these recently, but every time I go in there, not intending to film, can I say, like just going in there, cause you guys know, like I'm in there all the time, I love it. I went in there the other day with my mum and we come out with so much lovely like Christmas stuff, gift stuff, some absolute bargains, like stuff I've never seen in there before. Literally cannot wait for you guys to see what I've picked up. I've got a big bag full of stuff to get through. I've also made a point as well of filming all of the Come Shop With Me clips of stuff that you guys wouldn't have seen in my videos already. So if you're worried that you're watching this video and you're like, oh my god, she does these all the time, rest assured that I'm going to be sharing with you stuff that I've not seen in there before, brand new stuff that's brand new in for like November, December 2021. So without further ado, we're going to do what we always do, where I'm going to share with you the Come Shop With Me clips first. You guys can see first time what's in there and then stay tuned to the end part of the video where I'm going to be sharing with you all of the amazing bits that I got. So without further ado let's head to Home Bargains and let's see what's in there. Right, so I've just gone to the tan and look what they've got. They've literally got the skinny tan, insta tan melt chocolate. They've got milk chocolate here. They've got dark chocolate which I'm going to pick up one of. They've got Bondi Sands everyday gradual churning milk. Down here as well I've just seen they've got some of the skinny tan seven day tanner. In dark they've got the body glow so I'm going to grab one of these I think because it's normally $21.99 um, and then I think I'm also going to grab one of these ones as well for $1.99 because I just think it's an absolute bargain. I only noticed it because I was going to go and buy some more of my St. Moritz but yeah as soon as I seen this I thought I can't not so decided to pick up one of those. Over here I've just spotted this oil control mud mask for 69 p which comes in like someone's opened it it's not me I promise but <laughs> like a little tube mask there they've got some of these bamboo sheet masks oh uh, they're normally seven pound they look really nice actually make a nice little gift these down here cosmetic bags look at these elegant touch stick on nails we've just seen as well they've got a coral what's this one like a nice pink one let's see the one you picked up it's like these glittery ones how beautiful i might get one as well actually so nice got really cute headbands as well guys like, i love this one got like a red glittery one for christmas this one as well, these like cute Diamante ones. Spotted these cute like little Dr. Paw Paw red lip balms as well. Cute hand gels as well here, I've just seen this one which is blueberry muffin scented which I think looks really 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 nice. All cute, what are these like little cupcake on a stand decorations, they've got some really nice ones in here, they've got macaroons, little duck, oh my god with like little pom poms, ballet shoes, uh, perfume bottles. These are so cute as well. These are all like faux fake plant bouquets with the snow on it. Literally obsessed. I might grab some actually. Really lovely decorations here, guys. They've got more macaroons, they've got cocktails. This little like hot air balloon one I think is like so bloody cute. This giant one up there. Loads of arts and crafts stuff here as well, guys. Really love this gingerbread house treat wall thing. Like you build your own. They've got honeycomb tree decorations. Make your own snowman. Make your own snow. What are these? Make your own advent calendar. There's like these mega craft tubs as well. Look at these gin glasses. I obsess over them every time I come in. Like they are literally so beautiful. They're all hand painted as well. I think it's two forty nine with some nice tissue paper and make the loveliest like Christmas Eve gift. If you want some drinks, use them on like Christmas and Boxing Day. A bunch of different decorations here. We've just noticed these as well, and they're car decorations that you literally stick on your car to make it look festive. There's like <laughs> reindeer antlers. They've obviously got candy canes. What are these? Light up berry tree. Natural dried moss. Oh, okay. It's kind of cute. Make your own wreath. This. Light up wooden snow house. Oh my God, that looks so expensive. That doesn't look like it at all. They've got cute nutcrackers. And like a rocking horse there. What is this? Oh my God. Metal decorative elf. Christmas store. Oh my god, you put it on trees and stuff. That's so cute. Loads of alcohol here as well. We've just seen the Christmas pudding vanilla and custard stout. It's 159 and I'm kind of tempted to get one for my dad as like a joke, like see if he'll drink it on Christmas. This is really cute as well. What lies beneath it? It's like a oh look, it's like a fishy like ocean theme and it's really glittery. And it's violet gin liqueur. I think 5.99. That's really, really, really good. Little like chutney and relish gift set there as well it looks very like farmhousey eve boxes oh my god look they're actually like proper like wooden quality as well what and they light up oh yeah there's a sticker i light up oh my god yeah they light up on these bits a little colorful one 
special delivery one. Obviously, I am obsessed with these. I haven't used these yet, right? But I think they last so cool. The 99p, you get eight in there. Just spotted these drink and dice as well. They're literally only 49p, guys. But I thought they just make a really nice, like, stocking extra. We've got them in different colours. got matchbox quizzes here. There's, like, pub quiz, sports quiz, charades, music. All of these imperial leather bits, I think, look really, really nice as well. Like, the Let's Flamingo. It's really nice. <laughs> Got magic potion, disco fever. Oh look, donuts and ice cream. Foam first body wash. They got a raspberry one. More gift sets up there. What's that? Oh, it's like a Radox sleepy set. Yeah. yeah oh look, a bit of links. Java, 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 Java. Links Africa, which I feel like staple. Get these little drink bottles as well. <laughs> oh my god. Take two, but it literally looks like cake sprinkles in there and I kind of love it. Choose happy. How cute is that? Look. Little like ceramic soup mugs or bowls and they actually look really nice. Here there's teddy bear fleece duvets. They've got these amazing chunky lit throws, which I just obsess over. I mean, my rings would definitely catch it, but really really nice just spotted these which are so cute as well they're little angel tokens you give them to people so you've got like sister peace nan i'll give one to nan as well coming down to the foodie biscuit aisle which i love so much oh look they've got reindeer cakes down there cake orange jaffa cake your logs oh my god dream six ice top mince pies now i it's controversial but i don't like mince pies if these were like a dead jam inside or something i'd be all over them and i know they do do some somewhere but for those of you that do like mince pies i think these are quite festive but deep filled mince pies oh look mini mince pies it's a christmas chalk here oh my god look at that massive box of fingers <laughs> i wonder how much that is 4.99 We've got Fortnance mint squares, hazelnut squares. What are these? Oh, cream selection, orange and mint. They've got orange and mint wafer rolls. So, oh, salted caramel squares. That's a bit more me. What are these? They got Christmas butterfly cakes. Oh my god, they are actually really cute, and they're quite in date as well. Look at these gins down here as well, guys. They've got Dream Chaser cotton candy gin. We just appreciate how expensive these look as well, like six ninety nine. I think that's so good. They've got raspberry ripple, color changing unicorn, key lime pie. We've got these over here, which are quite like funky as well. Sherbet gin liqueur. They've got orange, lemon, raspberry. Again, really, really, really good. I think for the price. Oh look, they're normally twenty two pounds. So bargain okay, so like i said i did actually get quite a lot of stuff in there i feel like first i'm gonna have to go for the bargain of the year here um obviously you guys would have seen from the clips i managed to find some skinny tan in there if you guys haven't heard about skinny tan before it is a tanning brand that you can buy at like boots and super drug um and it's actually quite expensive it's normally like 20 to 25 pounds and i basically come across some skinny tan stuff and it was only 2.99 in these gorgeous boxes as well i think the packaging for skinny tan is so lovely so i decided to pick up three so this is the skinny tan seven day tanner so it is in the shade dark because that's always the one that i use it's apparently got a coconut scent um and it's also meant to be really streak free and natural looking now i don't actually have any tan on as you guys can probably tell but i do love to fake tan especially around this time of year I'm actually planning to go into home bargains to get some and then when i seen these i just got these instead i decided to get two for me um and then i also decided to get one as a gift for someone just because i thought that they would be a really nice gift to receive as well and the fact that these are normally $21.99 and I've got them for $2.99 I literally can't go over it. Just think that they look so so cool. I'm so excited to give them a try. I can definitely like let you guys know in a future video how I get on with them. And then staying on with the theme of tan, they also had some of the skinny tan chocolate range. Now again, this is something that I have seen in Superdrug before, and just because it's chocolate and it's meant to smell like chocolate, I was like all over it. I really wanted to try it, and I actually nearly bought it once for full price, but I didn't bother. So the fact that I've seen these in here for only $1.99, I had to get them. You see, these ones were a little bit cheaper than the other ones before, um, but this 
this is basically instant tan melt um that's what it's called which just sounds so nice it is a bronzing instant tanner it's meant to have a satin finish it says on here that it's suitable for your face as well which is really 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 good because a lot of tans aren't actually meant for your face but people use them so the fact that you can use this for your face is really good it's gonna last all day and it washes off um and this one actually is vegan friendly as well which is really good so if there's any of my watches that are vegan or vegetarian this one's going to be for you i literally i'm just obsessed with the packaging it's basically like a chocolate bar if you guys can see that um and again i couldn't just pick up one i decided to get two for myself to stock up and then i also decided to get another one for a gift for somebody else because i just think like you could do such a cool gift set hamper wrap it up with some nice tissue like how amazing would that look i am really really interested to see how these smell because they are meant to have a dark chocolate scent um now i don't know if i actually said or not but i did get it in the dark shade again I had a few they had it in light chocolate medium chocolate and dark chocolate again i do use dark tan because i am very very pale so i did decide to go with the dark shade the next thing i decided to get are some glue on manicure nails now these are the elegant touch ones um, and these are in the short stiletto one. I don't know if you guys can see that but they're basically pink and they've got glitter on the tips and I am literally obsessed. I think these look so 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 funky. I've got a wedding coming up at the end of December just before Christmas um, and I could really really do with some stick on nails. I don't really get my nails done. I mean don't get me wrong I'd absolutely love to get my nails done but obviously I get my lashes done as well and my brows and things like that and I'm a student and I just can't afford it so the fact that these were $1.99 in there I thought was an absolute bargain. You guys would have seen from the clips they had a few different colors and styles as well these were the ones that i picked up because i just thought that they looked the most neutral but the glitter on them just gave it a little something extra and then also in the beauty section um is something that i've actually already used um but for the purpose of this video i kept the packaging so i decided to grab one of the blister x intensive moisturizer lip balm cream whatever you want to call it i'm honest at the minute i've had the most dry and like cracked and like gross lips i don't know if it's where it's getting colder and just like the weather changing and things like that but i don't normally get it in winter and this year i've struggled so so bad i'm born i was in sick form that i got it bad one year um and i decided to pick up this and it is a lifesaver when i tell you this is the best lip balm i've ever used in my life it's so good i have tried vaseline i've tried caramex i've tried a lot um and honestly i go back to this one every single time it's more of a cream consistency rather than a lip balm so it's not quite as like jelly so with vaseline it's like petroleum jelly it's not really like that it's more of a cream kind of almost feels like you're putting coleslaw cream on you but trust me it smells really minty as well it's got like a really nice like eucalyptus smell i've actually got it underneath my lipstick today just makes my lipsticks glide on so well as well like it's worth it just for that in my opinion moving on into the christmas gift section um now i only actually got one thing today because again they didn't have a huge variety there wasn't a massive amount since i'd last been there but i did find this which i thought was so so cool so it's basically a like drinking dice and you roll it and it basically tells you to have a certain amount of drinks I had them in a bunch of different colors and they were only 49p and i just thought that these would be really good as like a little extra a little stocking stuffer or something just thought 49 p literally couldn't go wrong couldn't get over it, it was so cheap i kind of have regrets about not just buying myself one because i feel like they're just good to have in the cupboard say you're having people around for like pre's or afters or whatever and you just want to have drinking games it's just something like you know when you're all sat around the table and you're like what should we play as a drinking game and no one knows you know you're going for like piccolo or something whip out your cube or your dice and go for it another little cheapy gem that i managed to find in there were these so these are guardian angels and they're just little like metal silver little plate things basically they were only 49p which i thought was really 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 good um so they had a bunch of them they had like friend sister mum nan i decided to get one for my mum because i feel like this is just something really cute and sentimental i can just put it in with her christmas stuff it wasn't very expensive but it's just quite cute to have i feel like you could put it in like your purse or something and i also decided to get one for my nan because i know my nan would like love this like this would be right up her street she would definitely keep it my nan's super sentimental and she loves like little things like that so i decided to get one for her as well just what they're little cute extra and for 49p they were really really good so i decided to get those in the home section and the final thing i decided to pick up for myself in home bargains was a terry's chocolate orange which i know you can get these all year round like it's a universal thing though that everyone treats these like christmas chocolates like i never have them any other time of the year except christmas i mean maybe that's just me maybe i'm weird they are just christmas chocolates in a nutshell for me i love them it was literally a pound and yeah i haven't decided if i'm gonna keep this for me as like a little sunday eve treat 
or I'm gonna give it to someone for Christmas. All depends if I'm hungry later, I guess, if I'm fancying it, I might have a little segment, who knows? So of course I had to keep up the tradition and get a Terry chocolate orange. <laughs> okay, so that was everything I decided to get from Home Bargains today. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please do remember to give it a big thumbs up and of course, hit that subscribe button if you're new because it's so lovely to have you here. I've got some really cool Christmassy ideas coming up. Um, now, I'm not sure what day I'm gonna be uploading this because I have been so overwhelmed with uni assignments at the minute they've kind of all been due in at the same time um, and I've had two essays in the space of two days and it's all just been a bit manic we're pleased to know that just before I filmed this video I actually sent off my last essay of the year so pretty pleased with that I won't lie probably why I'm feeling in such like an upbeat mood like you know when you just like get rid of some work that you need to get done and then you just feel like you can just have a laugh I feel like I've got a little bit more free time for my videos and stuff now so depending on when this goes up um there will be more videos coming I promise I hope you guys have a lovely rest of the day and I'll see you all very very soon for another video bye